Hello and welcome guys, here is the next Substance Painter video and in this one I will add a rust material from Jacko to the Blender Suzanne model. The link to the asset can be found in the description. First I add Suzanne to the viewport here in Blender 2.79 and don't forget to check Generate UVs. Then I add a subdivision surface modifier to it before I export the mesh as FBX. Just enable Mesh and Selected Objects. After that I open Substance Painter 2017, create a new project and add the FBX in this dialog here. Ok, here's the mesh and the first thing I do is to bake the textures as 2K, check the low poly as high poly and bake all the textures except the ID map. Great, now I will import the Jaco Rust material and then I will drag it to the layer stack. The material has some inputs for curvature, position, world space normal and ambient occlusion, so I drag these textures that we just baked to these input slots. Now the material uses this information for example for calculating the leaks or edge wear. Ok, then I check use position map for rust leaks and I use a triplanar mapping. I also enable edge rust for the model and I change the amount of this rust, the contrast and the smoothness. There are two different rust types as you can see here, which both look really cool, but I stick to the first one. Then I adjust the overall rust level, perhaps change the amount of leaks, and after that I changed the color of the metal. Ok, basically I think I will keep these values like this. Now I'm just playing a little bit with the view and display settings of Substance Painter.
So I like this material very much thanks to Jerko for creating it and you can get it for a very low price on his Gumroad page. Guys I hope you find this review useful and if you do please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel to not miss the next video. Thanks for watching this and thanks for your support if you support me on my Patreon and come back soon to JNM.